Welcome back, everybody. Hope everybody had a good weekend. Let's get right to it, shall we? All right. First off, first thing I want to point out is the sun is coming up on this new camera that they just put up. You'll see this area up here. It's kind of dark, not really illuminating. It's where the light stops. And as you see, it's illuminating a lot sooner than the rest of our clouds. And if you keep an eye on it, you'll see the, it come down or actually just kind of sit there unlike the rest of the clouds that are moving on by it and there's the sun finally coming up not illuminating that <laughs> and the sun kind of seems stalled there for a second it's because it's going up behind something you can see the cutoffs on this side mostly see that wild cutoffs as the sun finally gets out of range of the, of the lens it should cast a shadow down across the top of it oh, oh, ran out of footage, alright good enough, look at this big old thing light going across the whole bottom of the sky and here comes the sun wrapping up Looks like it's uh, breaking light around the, to the left. It's also really wrapping around whatever's in front of it there. As you can see all the shadow to the left there, the clouds just kind of drifting over there and dropping into shade. And over here you also see another planet that it's coming up from behind. And look at all this, look at this shadow line. How obvious is that? I mean, it's really easy to see. I mean, you can see that one over there too, as the sun finally lets go of it and just reflects off of it now. And as the sun gets higher, you can see it's definitely going around something here. See that? There's that planet there. There's that planet there. You can see how the light's going around it quite a bit. Watching it back up and go back around. I mean, even right here, you can see the light is breaking around something. Look at how dark everything is over on the left. I mean, it's, it's not rocket science. And being the sun is so bright, you have to, you know, know how to pay attention to the shadows that are in the sky. Because, I mean, look, the sun is, light is going up and around something there big time and the Sun actually comes up over there all this light here in the middle that is reflecting off of something else see how it's bending down here and now again that is the most lit up part of the sky and there's really no reason for that the Sun comes up over to the right all this area over here is illuminating from behind the clouds as you can see it's a great big purple thing um, the light is reflecting off of it and just to be certain I mean once the Sun does come up it will be the brightest thing in the sky and thus this will no longer be the brightest thing in the sky and it will become a dark place in the sky because it will no longer be reflecting light. See, sun comes up, and now it became the darkest place in the sky. Imagine that. See how the light's just bending down around there? All the clouds that are coming over are just dropping into this shaded area, and disappearing. These clouds back here aren't even coming forward, they're just kind of sitting there.
And as you see uh, way over here to the right, look at all that reflection time before the sun ever pops up. And if you look at the sun's reflection, you'll see that it's definitely coming up around the side of something. And this is all the illuminated bottom of whatever it's coming up on. And the sun's coming up and going around this area as well. As you can see, shadows being cast. Lots of shadows being cast. The sunlight just kind of hung around in the middle until it finally got up and out of the way and leaped up there like it like it would. <laughs> wow, look at that red. That is a beautiful sunrise. Look at all that reflection. See all that green? Look at the sun over there. <laughs> It's all pink. Just goes to show it's still coming up behind the side of the, the red planet. And over here, we're seeing a lot of uh, blurry, dark clouds. Uh, it's also part of the sky that's being blocked of light. I mean, you can see how the light's reacting right now over here. You see there's something here. You see there's something here. And definitely something bigger up there. And look at the clouds. They're going opposite directions. Going into each other. Let's back that up and look. I'll show you. See how these are going out? See how these are going out? <laughs> See how the light's wrapping back down around the top of something? It's kind of bending around quite a bit over there. Just another look. I mean... You know, the light's breaking around this right here. Really bad now. And over here, it's bending around this. Up here. And again, the clouds going different directions. Totally unilluminated. Now, this is a wide sky view. Look at all that reflection first. All that light bending around something, going down and under. Look at all that reflection back there. See all that? This shouldn't be reflecting. All of this should not be reflecting. Where the sun is is where we should see it. Not reflecting everywhere else behind the clouds. Look at all the different colors. Look at all that reflection. Look how green it got over there for a second. All that green, look at that. Tons and tons of green over there. Alright, next location. See how the light is breaking around that? Let's go back and look at that. See how that light was roll right off the top of that? See? That is going underneath something round. See that? The light, the sun's coming up way over here. It's reflecting all the way over here on something very large. And the light is going around it. Because as the sun comes up, the reflection gets lower, as does the light. And as the sun keeps coming up, you'll see right there will be the darkest spot and it will even cast shadow as, as well. See how the light's breaking around it again? And all that shadow right there. All of these clouds that are just sitting over here, you can barely see them, but they're there. Here's your standard flares or planets by some people's opinion. Look how dark it is over here. I mean, there's See how those clouds just go right back into the shade? They don't hang around very long in the light at all. Now the flares are gone as the sun moves up past the lens. As you can see right up here, this is all still dark. Even though the sun's way up there, this is all dark. This should all be illuminated like crazy. 
like these as they go into the dark. <laughs> All right, everybody. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Please share. Sunday so brightly up in the summer sky. I shouted at the mountains, watch me shine and fly. But then cracked the thunder and the heavens cried. Our world torn asunder. Her heart said goodbye. Now I'm standing in our ashes Feeling the sunshine once again I move to the horizon Feeling the sunshine once again Feeling the sunshine once again Feeling the sunshine Up in the summer sky I shouted at the mountains Watch me shine and fly But then cracked the thunder And the heavens cried Our world torn asunder Her heart said goodbye now I'm standing in our ashes Feeling the sunshine once again I move to the horizon Feeling the sunshine once again Feeling the sunshine once again Feeling the sunshine